Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be kind of like the next installment in my house tour. I already went ahead and did the dining, kitchen, whole living, like main area of the house. If you guys want to see that, I will leave a link for it right here and also down below in the description box. But today's video is going to focus on our master bedroom and the closet and the bathroom, that kind of stuff. So Michael and I have had a lot of fun doing this together and picking out pieces that are affordable. I hope that you guys really like it. We've had a lot of fun with it. So let's go ahead and get started. So the white curtains are from Ikea and the rods are also from Ikea. I love it because they have the little, I'll show you. The part I like most about them is that they come with the little tassels to kind of tie them at the side. So I really wanted like white sheer curtains in here. I think it's very pretty and very calming and peaceful and it lets a lot of light in here throughout the day. So they're really pretty. I'm really happy with them. And then down here below the window, we have this really pretty bench. We originally got it to put at the foot of our bed, but once we moved in here, we realized that was gonna be way too tight. This room is not very big, so it fit perfectly right here. We just keep extra sheets and pillows and blankets and stuff in there. And this is from Joss and Maine. It's just the linen color, basically the same color as our couch, and then it has distressed wood. It's really pretty. So you guys can see the detail of the wood right here. It's gorgeous. It looks almost like rustic, antique, but, but really still fresh with that linen material. I just love it. So this is Michael's side of the bed and we each have matching nightstands that I got from Joss and Maine, um, but they're by Universal Furniture and it's like the Paula Deen line. I have loved her furniture for a long time now, um, but it's fairly expensive, so I was so happy I found them on a great deal on Jocelyn, Maine. Um, I think they're called the Addison Nightstand, but I will leave all details below. So almost everything on our bed that you see here is from Home Goods. The big white pillows, the blue and white floral pillows, the light blue blanket, the comforter, all from Home Goods. The two navy and white striped pillows in the front are from Joss and Maine. The actual bed is also from Joss and Maine. It was so inexpensive and I don't know if it's the most amazing quality, but it's beautiful. I love it. I love the color. It's like almost like a denim gray blue color. I love the nail head trim. It's really cool. Here's a better view of the blanket. Like I said, it's from Home Goods. The brand is Ralph Lauren. It's a powder blue cable knit blanket. I also wanted to mention our mattress. Michael and I got sent a Casper mattress to try out and we're really loving it so far. It's great quality, so I thought I would mention it to you guys. It's a very high quality premium mattress at a really like outstanding price point. So Michael and I went shopping for mattresses, you know, kind of like in our area in the showrooms. And it was really difficult because you only get to try it out for like two minutes. You just lay there in the store. You don't know if it's exactly the right mattress for you. And they're really expensive. So we noticed that they were around $1,500, which is, which is really expensive. So Casper mattresses are between 500 and 950, depending on which size you get. We do have the king here. They can keep the price very low because they're cutting out that middleman of going to the showroom. It's all done online. All of the mattresses are made in America, which is awesome. Uh, it's very comfortable too. It's super high quality. You know, it has a little bit of sink to it, but it's still very supportive and comfortable. They've combined two different technologies to kind of give you like the perfect mattress. So there's latex foam and memory foam in the mattress. When you go to a showroom, you lay in different beds for like a minute or two, and then you need to make your decision right there. So you don't necessarily know if it's going to be comfortable 
for the long haul and when you're sleeping on it every night for years to come. So what's awesome about Casper is that you get to keep it for 100 days. It's like a risk-free trial for 100 days to make your decision whether or not it's the perfect mattress for you. So it's free delivery to your house, which is awesome. The returns are painless if you do decide to return. Like so Michael and I absolutely love this mattress. It's so comfortable, it's so supportive. If you guys wanna check it out, they're actually offering $50 towards any mattress for my viewers. All you have to do is go to casper.com slash Alex Garza and then enter the promo code Alex Garza at checkout too. So you'll get $50 towards any mattress of your choice. So here is my side of the bed. I have the same nightstand, Paula Dean from Jocelyn, Maine. Our lamps are from Pier 1. They're a beautiful turquoise clear base with an off-white shade, but it kind of lights up to look more of a green yellow color. It's really pretty. Um, we do each have some coasters on our nightstand from Home Goods. My picture frame is also from Kirkland's and I have some white roses. That's just a um, like fake flower from Home Goods. And then I have my jewelry box from Lily Pulitzer and some perfume from Chanel. Our dresser is also from Joss and Maine. It's another Paula Deen piece. It's a beautiful off-white, kind of like distressed wood. I love the handles. But as you guys can tell, we definitely keep this room more calm and, and plain. There's not so many knickknacks and decor items. It's a lot easier to keep clean this way too. So we just have our TV and a candle from Bath & Body Works on top a little bit better view of the dresser it's huge and really heavy like that goes up to about my chest area like it's very tall it's oversized but I love it so making our way over here in between our dresser and our window there's this little nook that we did not have any idea what to do with it and I found this kind of like French country antique little window mirror thing at Kohl's and it's perfect. It fit perfectly in here and I love it. I know you guys are going to ask about this monogram. I got it off Etsy and I will try to leave the seller down below. It comes in a plain wood color and you have to hand paint it yourself so I painted it a mint color of course. Beautiful though I love it. All right and so here is our closet. Probably not what you guys were expecting. It is so unorganized. I can't even believe I'm showing you this right now, but it's just a long walk-in closet. Michael's clothes are all in the second half, except I do have a few dresses hanging right there because I needed like for like maxi dresses and stuff, but everything in the front is all of my stuff. Everything in the second half is his stuff. And then we have our workout clothes and our shoes over on this side. So it looks like it's going to be a really big, nice closet, but it's like put together so poorly that we could barely fit all of our stuff in here. I know it looks like a lot, but trust me, in real life, it's, it's not that big. But this is it for those of you that wanted to see our closet. All right, in the final little area of our bedroom tour is our bathroom. We keep it pretty plain in here. It's easier to keep it clean that way because we're using it all the time, you know, all throughout the day. So this is it. So we have the black and white granite countertops, just our toothbrushes and our hand soap, not much on the counter. There was no like ring for hand towels in here, so we bought this little hand towel holder thing from Bed Bath & Beyond. And the actual towel on there is from Kohl's. And our other like big bath towels, those are from Ralph Lauren. We have the same like washcloths and stuff too. And then over in the corner here, we just have two little glass canisters from Target to hold our Q-tips and cotton balls. Same rug as our other bathroom, little light blue rug from Target, and then the little shower mat is from Bed Bath & Beyond, I believe. The scale is actually from Meyer, the grocery store. So this is the smallest bathroom ever. Michael and I had to buy this little storage unit thing from Target. Shower curtain is from Kohl's. Michael picked this out. It's really pretty mint blue, white, and navy blue. It's like an ombre. And that is our bedroom tour. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. 
Maybe it gave you a little bit of inspiration. I will try to leave links for as many items as I can down below in the description box. Don't forget to subscribe because I'm filming my office beauty room tour next. That'll be up very soon. I'm literally going to film it like today or tomorrow. So it'll be up really, really soon. So subscribe so you guys are notified when that comes out. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate all of your support and especially your kindness in the comments. You guys are the best. So thank you. I will talk to you soon. Bye.